was fucking right. <laughs> Just then, Gordon puffed in the take on water. Oh, hello, Gordon, said Toby sadly. Are you pulling the express today? Who else but me? Puffed Gordon. You're lucky to always have passengers, remarked Toby. You know, Henrietta and I haven't gone this long without passengers since. Oh, not since my old tramway closed down. And Toby remembered. It was back in the good old days. Whoa! We had a line, called freight, and Henrietta was always bustling by passengers. This is actual footage. And always remembered But then they stopped coming back. My line was closed, and the good old days were over. It would be nice to have my own tramway again, sighed Toby, like having my own branch line. Oh, snort. Branch lines are just useless extensions of the important main line. That's all Sir Topham Hack cares about. And he popped the roof. What an asshole, right? Just then, Thomas popped in with some freight cars. He saw two, looking dismayed. What's the matter? asked Thomas. Oh, just miss being useful, replied Toby. If I could just have some work to do, he said sadly. Thomas smiled. Well, you can take that train of building supplies to Percy for me, said Thomas. They are needed up at the work site of the new main line extension. Then I'll be able to collect Sir Tottenham Hat early, and you'll have some work to do. Toby was excited, though the extension was news to him. Come on, Toby, said his driver. We'll take Thomas's branch line and give you a nice long run. Wow, that's close. Toby was now beaming with joy. He reversed onto the train of supplies and set off for the work site. But as he puffed down the line, he couldn't stop thinking. Oh. So, so top of the head, oh. Where's Thomas? I'm exhausted. Oh. He'll be here soon, soon as But we <laughs> must remind him not to spoil the surprise. Percy was puzzled. What surprise? Before his driver could answer, Toby arrived. Here are the building supplies, Percy, he panted. Toby, what are you doing here? He snapped. I'm sorry. Thomas said I could deliver these supplies for him. Is there anything else I can do to help? Percy eyed a long line of freight cars full of scrap and tree branches. You can take those cars back to the yards for me, he replied. The train looked quite heavy for Toby, but he agreed. He rolled onto the special junction, called a Y, to change direction. Buffered up to the heavy train and saw his way. Soon Toby was pushing the heavy train of freight cars up a big hill. He made a tremendous echo, but just as he reached the top, the weight of the cars became too much for him. His driver shut off steam and applied the brakes, but it was too late. Oh! Toward oh. oh. the work site, he saw. Oh. Right, Toby? He gasped. Toby was bubbling with excitement. Percy, this is my old tramway. And look, there's my old shed. I, I, I never thought I'd see it again. Just then, Thomas arrived with a work group and Sir Topham Hat. He spoke sternly oh, to Toby. Oh, no. You should know your own strength by now, Toby. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but I only wanted to help. I'm aware of that. I'm just glad to see you're safe. But it's a shame you spoiled your surprise. Toby was confused. My surprise, sir? Sir Topham Hat smiled. 
Yes, Toby. Our new extension is in fact a restoration. We are restoring and connecting your tramway with the main line and Donis's branch line. Ah! Toby grinned from bumper to bumper. He almost couldn't believe it. Oh, sir! Thank you, sir! He cheered happily. <laughs> when the restoration was complete, Toby oh. took a special charter of friends, old and new, down the line of the opening line. For Toby, it seemed the good old days here to stay. Yeah!